Hi, good morning. Today, I wanna do a little day in my life as a full-time stay-at-home artist who is also disabled and chronically ill. I woke up, I did my little dance break while I brushed my teeth. That's something important. Some mornings, it does take me a while to get moving, to get going. Today was not one of those days. This is my calendar. I was kind of looking at it to see what I have on my to-do list. I have a lot of plans. We'll see if any of them get done. For someone who is disabled, the only way that I can be productive is if I have enough rest. And that might be a nap later today. Hey Beans, do you want to go for a walk? Do you want to go outside? Let's go! Okay, we gotta put this on. on my favorite shirt and overalls and got my cane. Time for a walk. Lesson number one, always check your filming before. I filmed this morning and it's almost completely unusable, so I'm gonna retry. First of all, I'm already tired and sweaty and it's only 8.32 a.m. <laughs> I went outside on a walk with beans. Now we're both tired. Oh, hi. So I'd like to reshare the three things that I'm going to do today. Every day I like to figure out three main tasks for myself and then usually a little reward. <laughs> Today I would like to finish the two paintings that I started yesterday. Two, can I? Yes, two paintings that I did yesterday. The next thing I would like to make is some finished paintings, real content, because I have a bunch of finished paintings that I have not made final reveal reels of, so I need to make a batch of those. The last thing I would like to work on, at least to start, is my logo. A bunch of my next steps for the future, for my Curious Little Frog Instagram, for getting business. Can you not right there, please? She doesn't care. The logo is important for a bunch of my next steps that I'm really excited about to feel a lot more composed and together as a business. I did do the sketch. Great job, Brenny. For my reward, I ordered some Red Bulls. I think my reward might be a Red Bull. I don't like to have too much caffeine because it can dip. Oh, I don't like to have too much. Are you okay? I don't like to have too much caffeine because it can definitely give me stomach issues. <laughs> but on a day like today where I feel like it is pretty packed, I would love to have some rest and then rejuvenation with a bit of caffeine. Anyway, Red Bull sponsor me. It's 8.36, I'm tired, we went on our walk, we got our stuff out of the way, I got dressed, um, plan I planned out the day, so now I'm going to eat a sausage cheddar muffin and charge my phone because I didn't and it's dying and maybe rest for a little bit and I will get back to you when I start doing something. See ya! <laughs> I just had my breakfast and I drank my water and I took my meds and now I would usually rest somewhere until lunch-ish, but the lighting in here is really nice. I already have my tripod and everything set up. So I'm going to do the finished reels. Finished painting reveal reels. 
That's hard to say. Finished painting reveal reels. These are the three finished pieces that I have to share. This one, one of my favorites ever, my fire painting. This one, where my husband and I met and fell in love, beautiful. And this one, which is very Lisa Frank inspired and it brings out my inner child. For real. For real? Because I'm doing it for a real? Get it? Boo! I'm annoying. Okay, I'm gonna film those. Okay, beans. I just woke up from my nap. I don't feel good. So I laid there for about 30 minutes and I worked on my iPad, editing my next YouTube video. And that didn't make me feel any better. So I'm gonna drink some water and make myself a sandwich. And I think my Red Bulls are here. So have my water and sandwich and then as a reward and a pick-me-up. <laughs> Hopefully the lunch helps, actually. Hopefully the lunch helps get me out of this little funk. It's 12.56 p.m., so I slept a couple of hours. On my list, what's left on my list? Finish my paintings, I did the real content, start my logo. I can do that after lunch. Thank you. When they said my package was here, they didn't mean here as in my door like they usually deliver it to. They delivered it to the parcel lockers, which means I would have to go walk all the way over there. So I definitely have to wait until after lunch. I feel a lot better after eating and I drink like two things of water. I was feeling really dizzy and lightheaded, but my symptoms are a lot better now. So I'm gonna go get my Red Bull from the meal and then I'll be back to sit down, kind of reevaluate where the rest of my day is going. Okay. First of all, cheers. Feeling much better. After some food, a light walk, some water. Nice. And so now I'm gonna sit here at my desk. Let's show you my desk. Here's my desk. I have my sketchbook here with the logo that is unfinished. So I'm gonna take a picture of it. And then I am going to draw it on my iPad mini on Procreate. I did this sketch and I got some colors for a color palette. And so Sorry guys, no more work to do today. Beans is laying in my spot. Thank you. This feels a bit like breaking the fourth wall, but I am sitting here watching my editing through for the YouTube video that I'm going to post next. And so you guys will have already seen it, but I'm watching it right now. 
it should be the video before this. So if you want to watch that video, the one that I'm currently editing, it is called Autumn Leaves Chill Vibes Paint With Me, something like that. It is 3.15 right now, so I don't know how long I've been working, but I'm really glad I took a nap earlier in the day and then ate lunch right away because I was feeling nasty. I could barely make myself lunch. I was moving so slowly and I could felt like I could barely lift my arms, even though I'm still been resting them on my rollator. Productivity and rest are so intrinsically linked when you're disabled that, and I think just maybe just as humans, but specifically us as disabled people understand that in order to produce, we need to rest, we need to have energy, we need to have backup battery, and sometimes even resting isn't enough. So I'm really excited that I got to rest, then I got to have my little treat because it definitely is giving me a little kick. Nice. And also for the ways that I've set up my life to be accessible because otherwise this would this kind of day would not be possible if I did not have planned rest, care for myself um, by my partner, I had the meal prepped um, breakfast, I had stuff that was available to me for lunch, and I already had a little treat on the way. So that is all the things that was already accessible to me as well as everything that I was working on. So I am really thankful for the place that I'm at. For most of the last two years, I really needed 95% rest and maybe 5% productivity and that was on a good day. It couldn't be lifting, it couldn't really be physical. <sighs> Everything had to be adapted for me. I was using my mobility aids and sleep. It was extremely difficult. So now I need at least as much rest as I do producing. It's more like 65, 35 rest to productivity and that has been such an amazing change. And so sharing this day in the life, it's been about two and a half months since my surgery. And so sharing this day in the life in endometriosis remission feels really great. And I'm just so excited that I finally get to do this. Everything that was swirling around in my head for so long as I could do nothing about it. I'm really grateful to be right here where I am today. And so even though I did have a rough bit of my day, it's really nothing compared to what it was a few months ago. So Okay, this water is getting a bit too dirty, so it is going in the paint canister and the clean water is becoming my dirty water. Wow. Iconic. My done pile is bigger than my not done pile, so that's a win.
finished cleaning my brushes and now I'm going to take a little bit of a rest because I'm tired. Anyway. Okay, it is almost 7 p.m. now. I'm super tired. Um, the rest of the evening I was sitting on my iPad editing my next YouTube video. I ended up finishing the thumbnail and the description and everything and it is uploading to be posted tomorrow morning so that's really nice. My husband is home and he is cooking dinner and I'm so thankful for that because I've been staring at these two paintings and I still want to work on them. Either way, I'm going to be so tired tomorrow but today was really really nice. I'm just, I'm really exhausted. What do you think Beans? Say bye to the people.